Yo, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Today we're going to show you the science of cracking a cold one with uh, the power of infrared technology. So, uh, you ever had uh, those special sales, you know, two cases of beer at the grocery store, you know, you get a discount. Only downside is, boom, as you can see, that beer is around 20 degrees. That is lukewarm. So what do you do? Hey, man, you pop that beer in the fridge, you know, and then how, how fast does that stuff cool down? Nah, it's only at 13 degrees. That's not getting there. So then you put one in the freezer, right? Oh, yeah. What do we have right there? It's about, like, what? Maybe zero around that. It's not quite cold enough. So what we do up in the, this lovely place we call home, we go outside. As you can see, uh, it's not, uh, it is not the camera deceiving you. It is actually that temperature. And uh, if you can see, there's a little bit of a warm spot in the snowbank. <coughs> because it's, it hasn't cooled down to the temperature of the snowbank yet, but that is a nice frosty one, and it uh, is cold. I'm going to put it right next to the uh, other three sample beers, and we're going to see uh, who cooled down faster, actually, because I'm curious now. And uh, just to let you know, there's a little bit of condensation that's going to happen. It's gonna happen. Oh man. So here we have the freezer beer. Who is cold? Oh it's pretty close. It's pretty close. But uh you know, in case you didn't uh you didn't already know. That's that's what happens. Ciao for now.